it's a best of seven. It all comes down. This has been the long haul in the finals. I'm still. Uh, I'm going to check if he can uh, if he can hear us. Magnus, are you here? Yeah, sure. Yeah. Hey, congratulations. Thank you. Uh, Magnus, it was. Uh, it was very clear that today was a very tough day, not just on the board, but you were also going through a lot with your back injury. Uh, what happened? Are you feeling better? Um, so what happened is I was generally feeling great today. And then like um, half an hour before the game, I was just going for a quick swim in the opening, uh, sorry, in the ocean. I started running and something just um, happened. So. Um, uh, but um, there's a little less pain now than there was than there was before. So it's, I'm it's sure pretty. I'm sure uh, that uh, winning the set helps with with the pain a bit. Uh, Magnus, we're not going to keep you for very long because uh, of course tomorrow is a big day. Just quickly, briefly, you could give us your impressions about how the set went today. Um. Yeah, I think in the first game. Um, in general, it was okay. Um, it, I will just mention one moment, which is when he played queen b6 on, I would say, about move 30. Um, yeah, move 31. So he started shaking his head after he made this move. And I sort of, I, I guess I, I fell for the oldest trick in in the book right because i when he started shaking his head i just assumed he missed rook d1 and mm -hmm. it's game over um but of course after after rook d6 i have to start all over um but yeah it turned out fine so i won't complain all right and uh, of course 9g7 was a was a very strong blow uh, did you see it instantly when he played a6 yeah, a6 was uh, was very provocative, um, of course. But one of the, obviously one of the ideas of bringing the rook to c5 is to is to um, take on seven. And if I don't take, then my preceding play makes little to no sense. All right, and Marcus, big day tomorrow. Just your thoughts on the final day of this final? Um, it's obviously going to be obviously going to be tough. I feel like every every day has been has been difficult so far, and I don't expect this to be any different. I really wish you a very speedy recovery with the back injury, and congratulations on today's win. Uh, and we look forward to tomorrow. Just quickly, Peter, yes, uh, anything for Magnus? Well, first of all, Magnus, a very big congratulations. I thought you played outstanding chess today. Thank you. And uh, as far as your back is concerned, I strongly recommend find a masseuse, <laughs> get a good back rub, and I'm going to turn it over uh, to Peter. Yeah, congratulations, Magnus. Uh, yeah, it was a fantastic day. Very nice games, uh, total control. Yeah, there was this scary moment on game two, but knowing your situation, I don't want to ask you any question. Just hope that you will recover quickly and... Uh, yeah, looking forward to this uh, seven set tomorrow. Thank you. All right, Magnus, take care. And with that, the world champion levels the score and we get another action-filled final day tomorrow. The score is 3-3. Three, three. I think, I think yes, Peter, when this final began with these two extremely strong players, undoubtedly we knew that it was going to be an epic fight, but the way I, I think few of us could have predicted just the way the final's gone.